Hey guys, it's Chester out here in southwest Nebraska, keeping it real, sort of. Just got done tagging a few calves. Got the uh, the Grand Pooh Ba, Big Chief, uh, the Boss, A.K.A. Sunny, um, the Boss. We're headed back home because she's got to make supper. So we was out tagging calves, and she was running the camera, and uh, there was a problem. I mean, not big problems. She does have a little bit to learn in the art of videography and the camera operator's main job are they called camera operators you think cameraman cameraman the cameraman the main job of a cameraman is obviously to take videos of me the star uh, second responsibility of the camera person camera person see cameraman, camera person, whatever, it doesn't matter, is to keep me on track, keep me focused. Uh, Taylor sometimes does a good job of that, you know, because I'll be going along and then pretty soon I'll just veer off onto another tangent, you know, alternate realities and that kind of thing. Um, and it's their job to steer me back in the right direction. And not necessarily steer me back in the right direction, but when I run out of what I was going to say there, I mean, they need to get me back to where I started. That way I can finish my train of thought, because sometimes it gone and then I forget what I'm doing um, but anywho uh, I just got kind of got something stuck in my craw here that uh, that I've been thinking about since the cameraman's been with me the other night I get home after a long day long day um, take a shower get a little bite to eat so I'm going to bed and Sonny's already gone to bed I mean it, it is late it is real late 10 o'clock 10 o'clock. 10 o'clock's real late when you've already had a 14 or 15 hour day. So 10, I mean, it's late. Fairly late. Not really that late if you didn't do anything that day, but um, really it's early if you're a night owl, but anywho, it doesn't matter. Um, so I, 10 o'clock, take my shower, you know, eat supper, whatever. Head into bed and I walk in the door and, and Sonny's in bed, of course. He's like, what the hell are you doing here? And I'm thinking, well, um, this is bed. This is where I sleep. <laughs> So she's like, um, and this is how she said it, okay? She's like, um, I'm watching volleyball. And I'm thinking, well, Jesus. I mean, it pisses me off. Uh, it doesn't piss me off. So we're watching volleyball, or she's watching volleyball, and I'm like, well, there, and there are two things you do in bed, right? You sleep, and then the other one is how you make babies, okay? And uh, right now I'm 50 years old, okay? You know, several years ago, um, sleeping wasn't number one priority. Now, it is. And, anywho, she's watching volleyball. And, uh, who are you watching? Hawaii. Hawaii volleyball. Men's Hawaii volleyball. Men, yeah, men's Hawaii volleyball, okay? And, uh, so that right there kind of gets me going a little bit. I mean, it doesn't get me going. It <laughs> does the opposite of get me going, really, <laughs> if you know what I mean. So, men, I, I mean... It. <laughs> she, I mean, she does. And she's pissed when I come to bed when she's watching volleyball. I mean, I don't know what the hell she's doing, but the bed is made for, like I said, the two things. One, it's not made for watching TV or watching YouTube videos, and, unless you're watching me in bed on YouTube. That's fine. I mean, I encourage it, really. And women, men, it really doesn't matter because I don't, when I go to bed, I'd rather sleep. I mean, I can understand it, I guess, you know, because them guys, they're all, you know, gorgeous and seven foot tall and athletic as hell and can, you know, jump out of this gym. I mean, we're not in a gym, we're in a pickup, but jump out of the gym. Uh, so really, I mean, it doesn't matter. I mean, they are athletic and they're studs and I mean, I sure wouldn't want to be on the other side of the net when them things are flying at you about 112 miles an hour. I mean, they could, I mean, probably take your damn head off. Not me, because I got cat-like skills and I could avoid them. I mean, I couldn't send them back to them, but I could dodge them, I think. <laughs> I mean, they, they hit the ball pretty damn hard. And, uh, so, I mean, I think they get, like, when they get a kill down and it's, like, home run or whatever, it's, like, two points, I think, because they hit it so hard. Maybe. Because I think there's different rules for men's volleyball than women's, I think. 
there's not. Okay, never mind, there's not. But I mean, even the women's volleyball. I mean, you know, back when Michaela Fecky played for Nebraska, I sure as hell wouldn't want to be on the other side of the net when she's winding up on one. I mean, that could take your head off. I mean, the normal person said, because I mean, it wouldn't hit me because of cat like skills, remember? So yeah, I mean, that whole damn thing and, and just the way, and really just the way she said it. Um, I'm watching volleyball. I'm watching volleyball. And she, I couldn't see it because it was dark in there, but I'm sure her head went like this. I'm watching volleyball. And led me to believe that I wasn't welcome in bed. So I'm thinking that maybe, you know, TVs, all that could be outlawed in bed. I mean, if you want to watch TV, go to the TV room. If you want to watch uh, your phone, YouTube, go to YouTube room, phone room, whatever, computer room. My bedroom is my TV room. No, it's not. Yes, we decided a long time ago not to put a TV in the bedroom. I'm sorry. And that is exactly why, because sometimes I'm not welcome, which I wasn't the other night. My main point is, if you want to watch your phone, get the out of my bedroom. Language. They can bleep that out. And I do try watching my language because... As we learned in that video that was dropped the other day, the first video we did, they'll demonetize you if you cuss too much. So, or cuss at all, maybe, I don't know. I think you can say certain words. You can say fart, I know. I think fart's fine. Flatulence. Butt, buttocks. So if you see me go like this, sometimes I, you know, I want to say something bad, but biting my tongue is what I'm doing. All I right. really think you should watch a volleyball match. I have. I've tried. We've been in bed and should be watching these things. First off, the main problem with the phone in bed watching volleyball, um, people are this big. My sight ain't as good as it used to be. I can't see the damn thing. Uh, yeah, volleyball. Hawaii volleyball especially. Love them guys. The Rainbow Warriors. I thank you for their women. They're Rainbow Wahini, right? Yes. <laughs> see? <laughs> what do you call it? What? Representing oh, yeah. the Hawaii volleyball program. I don't know if it's just the volleyball program no, or just the Rainbow Warriors. Uh, the Hawaii. No, that's what I mean. Is it just volleyball shirt? Yeah. Or is it just the Rainbow Warriors? Rainbow Rainbow Warrior volleyball. Oh, so it is a volleyball program. Anywho, doesn't matter. Let's hope we don't see that in bed anymore. When I go to bed after 14, 15 hour days, I'd like to go to sleep. Well, so let's just remember. Try to keep it real out there. Later.